is up everyone welcome back to my channel if you are new to my channel hello how are you what's up what's good my name is Shara and welcome I do look like a hot mess and I am actually doing this intro at the end of organizing my closet so everything you see here is pretty much organized and I finally have a spot for everything which feels so good this video took me like four days to film it took forever by the end of this whole organizing and getting rid of things i'm i'm over it i'm over my closet i'm over clothes right now so when you see me filming and i'm in different outfits i have a full face on some days some days i don't have a full face on it's because i did this in sections and i kind of like divided it up so i didn't really overwhelm myself with everything and your mom you literally don't have all day to do one thing so i totally had to go ahead and section it up in a few days worth of organizing but we finished we got it done and i just wanted to take you guys along on the journey i'm thinking about doing a voiceover here and there to pop in and let you guys know what i'm doing because i really didn't talk much in the video i explain everything and how i organized of course at the end as well majority of the pieces that i do own are thrifted if you are wondering so i'm gonna stop rambling if you guys want to watch me organize then just here's my current situation i have a bin full of summer clothes that i seriously need to go through and then all my clothes right here in this little section so I'm gonna have to go through all that and get rid of what I'm not using and just kind of declutter and get rid of a lot of things it's needed much needed so I start off by pulling everything out of my closet I go into the drawers and I start throwing all the clothes that are in the drawers on the bed so this day I'm mainly focusing on all of the clothes that were in the dresser and I am sorting it into three sections, a section that I'm going to keep, a section that I'm going to donate, and then a section that I'm not using right now. Maybe it's like the season or maybe it's just something that I want to hold on to for just a little bit longer. We'll see. organized in my drawers and the ones I'm going to keep I end up folding them and I do that in this rolling method type way. I do this because it is easier to see clothes that are kind of folded and stacked on top of one another. It also saves space in the drawer I notice instead of just kind of folding it regularly but this is the way that I like to fold my laundry and put them in my drawers. Now we're into day two of organization. I go ahead and tackle this huge bin of clothes that I put away for the summer. A lot of my dresses are in this bin and I know I have been wanting to pull them out so I can wear them because it is humid out here in Japan. So definitely taking advantage of all of my summer wear. But there are some things in there that I didn't really quite want so I ended up getting rid of the things that I don't want. But my main focus for this day was to tackle this bin and pull everything out that I wanted, get rid of the things that I didn't want.
really taking this whole closet organization bit into sections. This is my third day of organizing. Yesterday, I mainly focused on this bin that we have. So most of the stuff that's in the bin is going to pretty much stay in there. Like they're kind of like winter clothes. And then I have clothes in the closet, which now I'm going to work on since I did the drawers. And then I have a pile of clothes that I'm going to donate and get rid of. It's literally taking me way longer than I expected, but it has to get done. It is much overdue. I need to stop playing. Just got to worry about this little section right here and this little section right here. Kind of organize it to where I can actually see pieces that I need and it not be an issue. So let's do it. I thought I got more footage at day three, but I guess I didn't. I was probably in the zone, but I literally just took all of my clothes out of my closet that was hung up. And I do the same process of getting rid of clothes that I do not want and then start to kind of figure out what I want to keep and put away. But I didn't just hang up my clothes just yet. As you can see, this is the following day, day four, I start to hang up all the clothes that was in that summer bin that I had. Hang up all the dresses, all of my summer clothes that I want to keep for the season and start to organize that way. tunnel I'm starting to hang up all the clothes that were in my room just literally piled everywhere back into the closet get some organization going on I definitely go through all of this at the end of the video and show you how I organize my closet and how I organize the drawers finished organizing my closet and getting rid of a lot of things it probably doesn't even look like I got rid of a lot of things but this is what I got going on for basically fall and summer usually I like to separate my clothes by seasons and I was gonna pull out all my fall things but literally I procrastinated this year and didn't get all of my um, summer things out at the beginning of the summer so I was like let me just leave it up and then I'm just gonna leave up some of the dresses that I've been wearing and it's still gonna be warm out for a while but it literally makes no sense for me to pull all of this down when I'm going to literally just pull it back out in probably like a couple months or so so I'm gonna go ahead and just show you what I have going on currently I did have this Alex drawer over here in this section back corner, but I stuck it over here and I'm going to, it's all empty because I did have makeup in it. I'm going to put like headbands, bandanas probably, you know, like bras, bathing suit tops, bottoms, stuff like that all in this. So it'll be better organized. And then I do have just like some of like my short sleeve button ups that I have hung up and I do have like my nice blouses hung up as well and then I go into like dresses and um, rompers and I have those hung up over here pretty much just kind of have like long maxi dresses down here in this back section and then I do have shorter dresses right here as we move this way I kind of have it categorized by like sleeveless tank spaghetti strap dresses and then um, my overalls and this actually is going to go over here there you go 
And then in this section, so this is like pretty much all of my long sleeve things, sweaters, cardigans. I have like winter jackets in this back corner and then I have all my chunky sweaters that I'm gonna end up wearing for the winter and fall season. And then I have like my hoodies, gym hoodies, stuff like that. And then cardigans, so I have all my cardigans just kind of grouped together so I know where they're at. My flannels and button-ups because I definitely wear those during the winter and fall. And then just like my nice long sleeve bloused shirts, I put them right here. I'm gonna probably put like my really nice uh, flowy pants that I've been thrifting here. I think I'm gonna stick them on the hanger and have them just kind of laid in the, to the closet as well but I have some of those all in the laundry. I'm gonna have to just do that as I go once I get more of my laundry out, which I know I don't have too much, so it's not gonna be a lot of clothes. This is just gonna be a whole new beast to organize. This is just a reusable bag. <laughs> but this is like beanies. I have mad beanies. And so I'm gonna have to probably house that in like the Alex drawers that I do have behind me. And then I have winter socks, like super chunky knitted socks in this thing. And then I have athletic socks in this thing, which I'm going to probably make it work and fit in my Alex drawers. I have bathing suit tops and all of my undergarments in here. So the next drawer below it, I just have some crop tops, tanks, Shirts like that, shorts. I have shorts right here for the summertime. I do prefer the rolling method. I, I feel like I can see things way easier when all of the shirts and whatnot are rolled up. In this one I just have gym clothes, crop tops for the gym, and like pajama pants over in that corner. I think I'm gonna put like my super oversized t-shirts in this and like shirts that I would have hung up but I didn't I kind of pulled them all out so I'm gonna put them in here and then I do have shorts and skirts and then I do have some pants and skirts and whatnot in here I feel like I didn't get rid of a lot but when I go through these drawers and they were to the point to where they were like jam-packed and they're not jam-packed anymore it feels good to see that I can actually see clothes so that's a win in my book. But yeah, this was so long overdue to just organize my closet, organize my things. This dresser, I think I'm going to invest in a new one just because um, this one I got off of the art sale page here and I want to thrift a really nice one. So I'm just gonna be on the lookout for that. You guys, the thrift gods came through cause literally the day after I filmed this video, I got this new dresser and I'm obsessed. Super excited I finally got it out of the way and now I can see all my pieces and everything's not like crammed in to the tub, which the tub that I did have, it's right here. And, and I do actually have like a lot of summer pieces in there and pieces that I'm probably not gonna use right now. So I just kind of stuck them all in there for now. All the rest is going to be donated. I have a pile, a huge pile for donation. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it wasn't really anything fancy. It was just me organizing. I figured I'd take you guys along with me. Like this video if you enjoyed watching. Thank you so much. I will link my Facebook page, my Instagram, and my vlog channel and I'll have all of the links down below as well. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!